without create the smooth zoom transition effect in Premiere Pro. I'm going to begin by showing you how to apply the smooth zoom transition effect to my first two clips over here. Move over to your project window, select this new item icon and select adjustment layer to create a new adjustment layer. Make sure that your adjustment layer settings matches your sequence settings and hit OK. Now drag this adjustment layer above the two clips that you want to add the smooth zoom transition effect to and move your time indicator to the middle of these clips. Go over to the effects tab and search for the transform effect. Now apply this transform effect onto your adjustment layer over here. Move over to effects control and deselect use composition shutter angle and change the shutter angle from 0 to 360. Scroll up to scale. Under transform, change the value of scale to 300. Select the stopwatch next to scale. And this is going to create a keyframe at that exact position. Hold down shift and hit the left arrow once to move back 5 frames. And select this reset parameter to reset the value of scale back to 100. Next, hold down shift, hit the right arrow 2 times forward and hit the reset parameter once more. And this will reset the value for scale forward back to 100 also. If I zoom in, you can see that we've created three keyframes over here. Select the first keyframe, right click, select ease out. Select the last keyframe over here, right click and select ease in. To move over to this arrow next to scale, select it and select this first keyframe over here. And you want to select this little blue dot over here and drag it straight until this line becomes very linear. And select the last keyframe over here. And select the first dot over here and drag it forward also until the line becomes linear. And if we go back now and hit play, you can see that smooth zoom transition effect. To apply this effect to multiple clips, adjust the length of this adjustment layer. Ensure that you are not cutting out any of these keyframes over here. To do that, move your time indicator to the middle of your clip so that you can perfectly see these keyframes over here. And now you can adjust your adjustment layer closer without cutting any of them. The next thing I want to do is to move all these clips together. And select my adjustment layer over here and hit M to add a marker to it over here. Hold down or drag this adjustment layer to the position where I want it to be. So I'm going to place this marker in between these cuts. Hold down Alt and drag this adjustment layer to another position over here. And just repeat the same process. Go back from the beginning and hit play. You can see that we've applied that smooth zoom transition effect to multiple clips.